Hello everybody and welcome to the Kinetic Coastings YouTube channel. Today we're going over how you can install Valheim Plus on your server. Now it's nice and simple, I'm going to show you two different ways you can do it. The first one's really quick, really easy, uh, and the second one's a little bit longer, um, but it's, it's still nice and simple all the same. Now before we dive in and we do anything, if we've already got a world, so we're already playing around a world and we decide to install Valheim Plus, it's probably best to make a backup first. Now you can do this by going to the backup manager here and then pressing create backup. So enter the backup name, whatever you want, and then press start backup. Then that way, if you muck anything up or you want to go back and you don't want your server to be modded anymore, you can just click these three dots here and press restore. Likewise, if you fully screw up your server while modding it, you can go down to the advanced section and go to rename and reinstall. And here you can restore your server fully to its factory resetting. The factory settings, sorry. So that, that will just merely to reset your server should you muck anything up, but you, you won't. It's nice and easy. Anyway, so the first thing we could do is we've got to power down our server if we haven't already. And then we're going to go ahead to the change game section here. And down here we can see we've got Valheim selected right now. And then here we're just going to press Valheim Plus. Now, if we have a world we want to keep, we're not going to slide this across. If we don't have a world and this is a fresh server, then we're just going to slide this across and that will install all the files and everything for us. So let me just say that again just to make sure no one mucks it up. If you've got a world that you're already using that you want to keep playing, don't slide that little toggle across. If you haven't, then we'll slide the toggle across and it'll reinstall everything for you. So if you don't slide the toggle over, it'd be like instant. Um, if you do, it's got to download all the files and stuff. It's got to, re it's got to install Valheim Plus for you. It's going to press change game like so. Now that's going to take a little bit and I'll come back to you when it's done installing. It's done installing for me. So if we just go to the file manager here, we can see we've now got a bunch of stuff like Bepin and uh, a bunch of extra startup stuff in here. So that means that we've now installed Valheim Plus. And now all we need to do is just go over to the uh, overview page and just press start. And you can see the server starting. We can just check it on our console here. There we go, server's loading up, and that's it. You've now got Valheim Plus installed in your server. Nice and simple. Now, what about if you didn't press that reinstall button? What about if there's a world you want to keep? Well, this is the second way I'm going to show you you can change your server over, just a little bit longer than the first one. Okay, so what about if you decided not to reinstall the server and because there was a world you wanted to keep? So you just press change game and you didn't slide the toggle across like I said earlier. Well, what, what doing this has done is set our server up to run the Valheim Plus mod. It's done all that stuff ready for us. It just hasn't reinstalled the server and download, downloaded Valheim Plus for you. So we need to install Valheim Plus ourselves. And that's really simple. Don't worry about it. But it has set the server and everything up ready for Valheim Plus to be used. So what we're going to do is just go to our file manager here. And then we're going to go to this link in the description down below. This is the Valheim Plus GitHub page. And you can see here we've got the latest update which actually came out yesterday uh, and this is the latest update and the latest version of Valheim Plus. So what we're going to do is going to scroll down to the assets area down here and we're going to press on the unix server.zip here. We're just going to grab that and that should go into our downloads folder. And once that's downloaded into our downloads folder we're just going to go and drag and drop it on here. You can see the little upload progress like so. Now once it's uploaded we see we have a unix server.zip. We're going to right click and we're going to press unarchive. There you go, that's now unarchived and downloaded and installed everything for you. We can then just go to our overview page and just press start. Right, really simple, your server's now running Valheim Plus. Dive in there, configure it, do whatever the hell you want to do with it. Um, we will at some point have a guide uh, of the best like settings to set for Valheim Plus. I don't think that'll be out at the same time this video will be out, but if it is, description down below. If you're new to Kinetic Hosting or if you just want to pick up a Valheim package from Kinetic Hosting, right now we have a 15% sale. That's a 15% reoccurring sale on all of our Valheim packages. You can head to kinetichosting.net. There's a link to this page down in the description down below. These two options here will automatically apply that code to your cart, or you can just enter MISSLANDS, all lowercase, into the cart at the checkout, and that give you that 15% off if you want to pick up one of our servers. Anyway, any questions or issues you have about installing Valheim Plus on your server and your Kinetic Hosting client, you can go to our Discord, which will be a link to description down below. You can also open a ticket on our billing panel, a link to that also down below. If you want to pick up a Valheim server and you're brand new but you have questions, then you can also head to our Discord and our support tickets. It's the same links in the description down below. Anyway, hope you have a fantastic day and enjoy Valheim Plus.